Back in March of 2018, Dothan resident Kenneth Glasgow was involved in the shooting of 23-year-old Brianna Jennings. As a result, she was killed. Glasgow was the driver to Jamie Towns, who was the person that actually killed Jennings. Now, three years later, a grand jury has dropped the capital murder charge against Glasgow, which was music to his family's ears. We've been praying for a long time, three years, for this to happen, and it's finally happened. In the state of Alabama, when a person fires shots into an occupied vehicle, it becomes a capital murder case, which is what linked Glasgow to the case. Kenyatta, Glasgow's daughter, says it was a heavy burden seeing her father go through this trying process. But his mother, Tina Glasgow, knew that God would bring her some justice. And I knew the God that I serve, whenever he got ready, it was really the trying of our faces. They also had a celebration party for Glasgow. For him to be able to beat those charges, for those charges to be able to be surpassed and moved on away from him, it's a wonderful feeling. While this is a celebratory moment for the Glasgow family, Lakeisha Reeves, mother of Jennings, is still in pain. While she was unable to speak to WDHN, she allowed us to use old sound of how her daughter's death is still affecting her. I have my days, I wake up, I miss her, but on the other hand, I know God is able. He's able and the Glasgow family is sending their condolences. We're not only just celebrating the life of him regaining, but also of Brianna. Our condolences go to the family, and they have since day one. In Dothan, Sarah Wilson, WDHN News for the Wiregrass.